developing android projects play a vital role in the, in the life of an android developer because android development project ranging from beginners to advanced level are not only the best but also the easiest way to learn android all you need to know is a basic understanding of the languages like java and kotlin earlier java was the official language of android development which is changed to kotlin in 2017 you can use any of the two languages to build Android applications. So before you get hands-on experience of the real world project, start with some simple Android projects to know what goes into creating and executing them. So let's see some ideas for Android projects. The first app is the Body Mass Index BMI Calculator app. It can be used to calculate BMI values based on height and weight. BMI is a fairly reliable indicator of body fatness for most people. For UI, we can use a text view to show the name BMI calculator. To calculate BMI, we, could, we get input from user. So we need two edit text, one for weight and another one is for height. A button to submit the values entered. Another text view or toast to display the calculated BMI. The calculation process is simple. We will simply divide weight in kilograms by the square of the height. Now, as per the BMI calculated, it will execute the respective if else statement. We are also checking if the user is pressing submit button without entering the inputs. In that case, we will display a toast message saying, please enter the valid height, height and weight. And the next app is a news app. Everyone using news app instead of newspapers nowadays. So we can make a simple news app using Android Studio. Before making the app, get any news API. For UI part, just add Recycler view in a layout, another layout with card view and text view, which is to be inserted in Recycler, Recycler view. With the help of DB helper and JSON object, you can show news from API in Recycler view. And the next app is a calculator app. Create a simple calculator which can perform basic arithmetic operations like addition, subtraction, multiplication or division depending upon the user input. For UI, two edit text for two user input, buttons for addition, subtraction, multiplication and divisions, a text view to show result, a button to clear the result for next arithmetic operation. For, a, for logic part, write respective codes to be performed. We can show a toast message if both the edit text are empty. The entered numbers in the edit text have to be first converted to double as the answer can be in decimal value. In order to display the answer in text view, we have to convert the answer variable which is in integer to string. The to-do list app. The simple to-do application is an Android project it allows the user to manage their day-by-day -day task report. This whole project has only one concept, that to record your daily tasks and to-do and to lists. For UI part, a list view, an edit text to enter a new item, a button to add item. We need to create a list of to-do items to display and an adapter to display them in our list view. We can add items in list by setting up on click to add item button. We can remove an item when the item is long clicked. For that, we can use an override method on item long click inside item click listener. Another app is the simple music player app. This is a very simple app suitable for beginners to learn the concepts. For UI pod, we need a play button to play our song, a pause button and a stop button. Add the mp3 file to the raw folder create a new object for music player. Media player class has an inbuilt function like start, stop and pause. We will use these function for play, pause and stop. And the next app is a tic-tac-toe game app. Many of us might be aware of the game and would, and would have played it with a pen and paper. Tic-tac-toe game app is one of the most common projects that any beginners in Android is recommended to develop. While developing this project, you will gain much exposure to the Android concepts and get hands-on experience. So let's understand the game flow first. So usually tic-tac-toe is played between two players. 
you are provided with a 3 by 3 board with a total of 9 cells. Each of the players need to fill in the empty cells with their assigned symbols. The players can choose either X or O as their symbol. The game is played in an alternate turn. In each turn, the player needs to mark an empty cell with their signs. Winning criteria is if a player can make a straight line containing symbols allocated to him, that player wins. The straight line can be in row, column or diagonal wise. The game draw criteria is if the whole 3x3 three, three three board is fully uh, full of symbols and there is no empty cells left out, along with this, if there are no winners, then the game is considered as draw. So, uh, these are all the UI required for creating a tic-tac-toe game. And the next step is a simple reminder app. This is a good project for beginner. A reminder app can help you set reminder for di different events that you have throughout the day. It will help you to stay updated with all your tasks for the day. This would be simple application just whose task would be just to remind you of something at a particular time. For UI, showing reminder using recycler view or list view, embedding a floating action button on the home screen using this, the user can add new tasks, adding reminders to SQLite database, setting the alarm using alarm manager and notification manager, showing notification using notification manager and pending intent, updating the manifest file with the necessary declaration and permission. In this, the user would be able to set reminders and time in the application. Users can schedule reminders that would remind them to drink water again and again throughout the day or to remind them of their medications and so on. This is another simple Android application which converts temperature into Celsius and Fahrenheit. For UI part, we are taking a temperature value in edit text box, two buttons, one text view for result, one button to clear result. We will be using two formulas, one to convert temperature from Celsius to Fahrenheit and from Fahrenheit to Celsius and display result in text view. Similarly, like temperature converter app, we can make currency converter app. A simple currency converter app to convert dollars to INR. For UI part, we need two edit text, two text views and a button. You just have to get input from the user and on click of button, dollar should be converted to INR. You can also use drop down for different currencies as shown in the image. And the last one is a simple max quiz app that contains a set of curated questions for simple addition and its answer and checks for the correction of the answers given by the user. For UI part, a text view for question, a text view for countdown timer, four buttons for options, one button for start, one button for play again, which should be visible once the countdown is over. You should generate a random values for each question. You can also try easy, hard and medium levels in this app. So these are the Android project ideas for Android development. If you have any queries, you can ask in the comment section or you can fill the form whose link is in bio for free counseling sessions from our industry experts. Follow us for more technical content like this. Keep learning, keep growing. Thank you.